fantastic show for you today. We're at L'Oreal Toronto Fashion Week at Nathan Phillips Square, where some of the top designers in Canada and the world come to showcase their collection. And today we're going to be talking with Toronto designer Dan Liu. Stay tuned. With me now is designer Dan Liu. He's a designer of Tatsuaki. So Dan, tell us a little bit about your collection. Um, actually, this time my uh, collection, uh, the theme of my show is the new me. Actually, it's um, the new me. Why? Actually, not just the new direction for Tatsuaki, but actually it's a new path for me to continue the design in fashion. So, of course, the new trend for Canadian fashion. So, so how does it feel to have your show on this runway? Um, I love it. You know what? I love it. I love the tent. I love this this site. It's beautiful because you know what? Before we are in CNE and it was really good already. But then right now it's even much better because the the city hall is right behind us, and uh, we, it's just so iconic right now. You know, people see right away Laurel Fashion Week. That's Toronto City Hall. People already know that this is Toronto. This is Canadian fashion. It's so good for the international image. So. Fantastic, Dan. I look forward to seeing your show, and I'll see you, you in a few minutes. Thank you. Thank You're you. You're welcome. Thank you. Later on in the show, the models will be coming down this runway for Dan Liu's show, and trust me, you do not want to miss that. But coming up right now, Asian inspiration reporter Teresa rubs elbows with garden enthusiasts from across North America at Canada Blooms. All this and more coming up next. a fantastic time here at L'Oreal Toronto Fashion Week and with me once again is Dan Liu. So Dan Liu, tell me, um, who do you see wearing your clothes? Who are you designing for? Um, I would think about uh, a young executive, you know, from 25 to 35 or even 40 years old woman who is, who, who understand design, fashion and who appreciate quality of clothing. At the same time, they, they they love the design on like they can go to work at the same time go to evening for fun at that without go home to change so so would that uh, would that be who your inspiration was a young executive um actually tatuaki themes is always is uniqueness and simplicity so it's always unique and simple and i try to keep this all the time that to make people look fabulous but at the same time they don't have to put everything on every day you know to look glamorous you know so to make the life easier life is already hard enough so well i definitely love your clothing and Thank where you. can i find it um you can find it uh, across the canada uh, across canada all the um, high-end boutiques and department store or um, in japan you can find it in japan some area in the department store and, and the boutiques as well so fantastic thank, thank you, you so much and we'll talk to you again in a few minutes thank you don't go anywhere because Dan Liu's show is coming up soon and you won't want to miss it, trust me. But up next, we'll learn all about the Asian Community AIDS Services Foundation. And in this week's Community Profile, we'll meet Alex Yuan. And coming up after the break, Asian Inspiration reporter Ryan will tell us why a picture is worth a thousand words to a group of Parkdale photographers. Stay tuned. Asian community and services. Hi there, we're back at L'Oreal Toronto's Fashion Week and with me is Michelle. Michelle is one of the models in Dan Liu's show. So Michelle, tell me, how did you find the clothes? Uh, honestly, the clothes were awesome. Everyone really, really liked them. We even want to all take them home now because they were so great. And uh, yeah, the show just went really, really great. So this is something that you would pay for? Oh, most definitely. Like I, this top here, everyone seemed to have a really positive response on it. And uh, it's really flashy, but it's still subtle. And yeah, I definitely want to buy it. Definitely wearable. Definitely, definitely wearable. <laughs> and, and the show, how did you think it was received overall by the audience? Um, I feel there was a really good crowd response. A lot of people cheering. Um, the models were having a great time. So was everyone else. So I think overall, it just went awesome. Yes, definitely. Everyone was having a good time. Thank you so much, Michelle. You did a fantastic job, Thank too. You. You're Thank welcome. You. <laughs> Take a quick break right now, but don't go anywhere. Asian inspiration reporter Brian takes us to Richmond Hill's newest Thai restaurant to find out just how special Thai food is. Stay with us. Thai food 
Yum, yum. Another thing I love is clothes. And we're back here at L'Oreal Toronto Fashion Week, wrapping things up with Dan Liu, designer of Tatsuaki. So, Dan, how do you think your show went? Um, to be honest, uh, I didn't know. Because, you know what, I am... I, no matter who going to my show, they will have a chance to see my live fashion show, but I will, the last guy on earth, will never be able to see my live show, okay? Because I will always be on the backstage, so I don't know, but I hope it's good, so. Well, the, the crowd seems to love it, to have loved it. How, how do you feel now that it's all over? Uh, it was so stressful. I was so stressed, but now I'm tired. Actually, you know what? Now suddenly I'm not stressed, but then the tiredness like kick in. Now I'm very, very tired. So, but, but I still have quite a few interviews and few after party to go. So, well, I, I'll hang in there. I'm having so much fun here at L'Oreal Toronto Fashion Week. The clothes are amazing. The hair, the makeup. <laughs> I think I'm in heaven. What's that? Time to go. That's all the time we have for today, folks, but I hope you had fun watching the show. Be sure to tune in next week when we visit Mayette's Fine Foods, and I'll be coming to you from another exciting location. Who knows? It could be your event, so let us know if you're planning something special. Email us your questions or comments at asianinspiration at rci.rogers.com. For Asian Inspiration, I'm Drew Sue.